The answer to all the questions on the previous quiz was maybe. And the reason for this is that whether or not something is an event depends upon the length and time scales we're using in a reference frame. So for example, a firecracker exploding, for us in the reference frame of our day-to-day -day lives, that would be considered an event. It's something that happens uh, essentially instantaneously, and it happens at a particular place in time. We can locate where it occurred. It's where the firecracker was. On the other hand, let's consider uh, an earthquake. So for us, an earthquake would not be considered an event. It's something that doesn't happen all at once. It happens over several minutes, typically. And it doesn't happen at just one location. It happens um, all over, over a wide region, all along a fault or something. But if we are considering a reference frame where the scale was maybe the entire solar system or the entire galaxy, and we were considering a time scale of 100 million years, say, looking at how the solar system might evolve, then in that reference frame, sure, that earthquake is an event. Compared to the solar system, Earth is just maybe a single point. Certainly compared to the galaxy, Earth would be a very well-defined little point. And compared to a million of years, a 10-minute earthquake is essentially instantaneous. So the main point is that an event is something that may be considered to be instantaneous, happen at a particular time in a particular location. But um, whether or not we would consider something an event depends upon the implied scale of the problem.